What's up, YouTube? This is Sully. It's been a long time since I've talked to anybody, done any reviews. Life just busy as hell. So, um, thought I'd do a quick review for you guys because I'm excited about this pair. Um, I'm sure you already know what it is. The one hand motion here with the knife. I hope everybody's been doing well, prospering, getting what you want, or if anything else, working for it, like most of us have to. So, earlier in the week, I had just gotten off work, and I work from home most of the time, and was just screwing around my phone, and I got lucky and saw the shock drop, or whatever the hell they call it, from Nike for these grails, as some would call them. Some like to call them the bread fours, like, you know, black cement fours, whatever you want to call them. But uh, here we go. There is the label. Uh, for a minute, I was like, size 12. Yeah, so sorry. This is looking the first time I've seen the women's sizing on there. Um, yeah, so let's take a look at these, man. I'm super excited. I, have, I have, haven't been buying too many sneakers this year. I bought the, uh, the, the Nike Adapts. I picked those up. And I picked up the candy canes last week. So, I mean, really, those are the only two major purchases that I've made. And, and then, of course, this came out of nowhere. But I had to jump on them. So there was no way. And getting lucky with a shock, shock drop for the first time ever. This huge. Oh, this is nice. This is so nice. Super dope. Super tight. I really hope that these don't start cracking right here like the uh, 2012 version did. Um, you know, I'm in my 40s, but I, when I was a kid, I couldn't. Have, my parents couldn't afford Jordan, so I just remember seeing these at school, in like elementary school. Um, and I was jealous. But yeah, these are dope. Um, it's all right. You know what these remind me of? This reminds me of the same new buck on the Thunder, the Thunder Fours. Maybe not. Yeah, I guess I guess the ones on the the these are better. Oh, sorry. Yep, barefoot today. I'm not gonna give you guys another foot shot. Don't need that unless you're into that kind of shit. But uh, yeah, these are super dope, super clean. Got the Nike on the bottom. They don't have the white perforations of the on the, the split grain. It's kind of a bummer. And let's take a look. Because I did break out my 2012 version. And I've worn the shit out of these. And you can tell all the paint chipping. Some scuffs in there. Look at that. That's just nasty. I think I tried covering it up with a Bic pen at one point. I know that's not ideal now. But, uh, I mean, overall condition of the shoe is still solid. Maybe a good cleansing. A douching of the laces. Maybe a little deoxidizing on the deoxidizing on the gray. But definitely, this is going into my casual, you know, beater bin. These will be replaced off the shelf with these. Because these are just amazingly dope so what'd you guys did anybody else get lucky anybody else that follows me did you guys score did you get yourself a pair um are you going to get yourself a pair i think i might actually try to double up on these when they roll out just because they're super awesome yeah bread fours cement cement fours cement black cement fours whatever you want to call them they are here. Got them. Super stu- Oh, no. What's that? I saw some orange. See that orange? What the hell is that? That's weird. It's like a little piece of- Like an orange dot. Let's see what is. What is that? Yeah, weird. Yeah. All right, well, not important, just a piece of plastic. 
here is the right shoe super clean man i hope anybody who wants a pair of these gets a pair uh, and i got a good feeling that they're going to be super gr so let's put that one next to this one let's see i could tell you right now the red on the on the 19 is more popping the tongue uh i mean jury will be out until um i actually don't do all the unlacing and everything eyelets so the gray is a little bit lighter on the 2019 sorry my shadow is affecting the image the red yeah, so the red, it's just a little bit more vibrant, it seems, on the 2019 with the 12. The red, let's see, the flight's all the same. Yes, my 2012 pair is a legit pair. I want to say I bought those on Black Friday. No, what's funny is I bought those when those came out, the, the, one, the Force 180s, those Tim Duncans. Yeah. What you guys think? You gonna get them? Let me know. Um, I'll try to do a review. I got those snake skins on, on hold at um, Foot Locker as of noon today, which is about 40 minutes ago. They were still sitting online, so don't think those are gonna be as hot. So maybe a lot of people scored on these. But yeah, all right, been a long time. Give me what, tell me what you guys think. I hope you guys are all doing well. Remember, buy what you like, forget the hype, and uh, peace.